So this is a wild shark encounter that happened in the Maldives. I can't 100% say, but it looks like a black tip reef shark to me. And I'm gonna break down for you guys what I think is happening in this video. So I'm gonna replay the beginning of this clip and watch this diver right here. So this diver down at the bottom, he appears to be holding some sort of rope with some cylindrical type object attached to it, which is connected to the shark. Some people in the comments are saying that it's a spear, like they shot the shark and that's why it's freaking out. But in this part of the clip here, you can see that it's actually, it looks like it's wrapped around the shark's neck. You can see right here. So it wouldn't be a spear, obviously, if that was the case. And you can see the line going past this diver all the way down, and then it's actually weighted at the bottom. And again, you can see all of this like bunching around the shark. So it's like attached by the neck and then this like loop and extra line that is still coming back behind it. And then at the end of the clip, you see this big object hanging behind this line that is connected to the shark swimming away. So I can't tell 100% what this is, but it wouldn't be a spear if it was weighted and hanging at the bottom. I don't know if the divers tried to like lasso the shark or put something around its neck. But I think more likely someone saw this hanging off of the shark and tried to help by pulling it or trying to yank it off. And then unfortunately, the shark just freaked out. This could be some type of gear. It could also be like some sort of anchor of sorts. It could also be some type of baited dive and the shark got wrapped around in like a bait chute and then the line connecting it somehow got tangled in it. I know that leaves a lot of uncertainty, but those are the factors that I think went into play or potential possibilities of what happened. But one thing I just want to point out for anybody that goes in the ocean, sharks and most, I mean, animals most of the time, like they don't know that you're trying to help. They're scared of you. And as much as we would really love to think that animals are connected with us and they know we're helping them, I think the cases of that are very, very low. And they're just scared. They're compromised. The shark is tangled. It doesn't know what's happening. It feels like it's getting yanked around. So if you ever are diving and you see a shark with line like this hanging on it and you do want to help, the best way to go about that is going to always be to cut the line if you can with a dive knife or some type of like diving scissors, something like that. Because holding onto it and pulling it will only cause the shark to freak out and we're not stronger than sharks are. But there is always the possibility the shark is going to charge back and freak out like that, even if you are just grabbing the line to cut it or you're even approaching them. So I would say leave it to people that are more comfortable with sharks and know their behavior just to avoid situations like this if they can, or at least minimize it. And have a better preparation to be able to handle some type of crazy reaction like that from the shark. I haven't even seen reports that any of these people were actually bit by the shark. It just charged and was running away, freaking out. And this is not a malicious shark attack. The shark just racing around trying to bite everybody in the circle as fast as possible. It really is just scared because of all of this line and everything hanging from him.